Hello everybody, welcome to the online session of Manulaw classes. As you know that every time we come up with some weekly vocab, just making me five words discuss karta hu that are very very relevant for your exam point of view. So chaliye, suru karte hain, aaj ka jo session hai without wasting any time. The first word in the list is expeditious. Abhi jo shabd hai expeditious, now let us understand what family this word comes from. Ye basically ek adjective hai. So, what is the verb form of this word? That is expedite. Kisi cheech ka expedite means kisi kaam ko jaldi se karana ya karna. To expedite something means to get work done, speedy work. The word expedious means done with speed and efficiency. Kisi bhi kaam ko jaldi se kiya gaya ho aur efficiency ke saath. Aisa nahi ki wo kharaab kar diya hai. So, that is called expeditious. Let us understand this word with the help of some examples. The first sentence says, the patient was saved because of the doctor's expeditious diagnosis. Abhi dekho yahan pe jo diagnosis hai that is a noun and the word is qualified by this word expeditious that is why we call it an adjective. So this is how you learn how a word function in a sentence. The second example is when I shop online, jyada tar log aap Amazon se, Flipkart se chije mangate ho aur aap ye bhi man mein aashar rakhte ho ki my uh, things should be delivered expeditiously hai na to aap ise as an adverb bhi use kar sakte hai so when i shop online i expect to receive it in an expeditious time frame matlab aap chahte ho ki jal se jal mera jo saman hai wo mere paas aa jaye so i do not think ki iske baad aap bhoologe ki expedite expeditious expeditiously ka kya matlab hota hai synonym iske hote hain quick and immediate and antonym hai jo ki delayed and slow i hope the first word is very very clear now let us talk about the next word in the list that is dreadful. Dreadful is an adjective. It's me. It means extremely bad or serious. कोई भी चीज़ जो बहुत ही बुरा हो या serious हो. For example, it was a dreadful scene. मतलब कोई नज़ारा आपके सामने जो कि अच्छा नहीं था आप उसे बोलते हो dreadful. Second, we passed a dreadful night yesterday. कल की जो रात थी बहुत सारे reasons होते हैं. Maybe just because of mosquitoes and all. आ कल की रात अच्छी नहीं गई. Maybe just because of cold, mosquitoes. There may be so many reasons. So synonym of this word is frightful and horrible. And the endonyms of this word is comforting and calming. So, koi bhi cheez jo ki bura ho, you can, uh, instead of using bad, if it is an uh, extreme, you can use dreadful in place of bad. The third word in the list is overweening. Overweening ka kya matlab hota hai? This is also an adjective, so it can be used for a person, situation or thing. Showing excessive confidence or pride. In simple word, you can say overconfident. कभी कभी कुछ लोग कुछ व्यक्ति अब ज़्यादा ज़रूरत से ज़्यादा confidence show करते हैं. So at that context, that that person may be called overweening. For example, bragging. Bragging मतलब होता है ज़्यादा पढ़ा चढ़ाकर बताना. Bragging about your numerous victories makes you seem a bit overweening. जब आप अपनी बारे में बहुत ही ज़्यादा बता बढ़ा चढ़ाकर बताते हो, that makes you look like an overweening person. C is driven by overweening ambitious. कभी कभी जो आपके लक्ष्य होते हैं, जो आपके to do list होते हैं, that is not doable. But you try to show that I can do it, and that time you look like an overweening person. So she is driven by overweening ambitious means उसके जो ambitious ambitions हैं, ठीक है, but कुछ ज़्यादा ही है. The synonyms are arrogant and overconfident, and the antonyms are egoless and modest. ऐसा व्यक्ति जिसके अंदर कोई भी ego नहीं है. So simply you can replace this word overconfidence with the word overweening. So they are interchangeable in all the situations. Now moving forward, fourth word in the list is proscribe. This is a law-related word, so this is one of the important words in the list itself. So proscribe means forbid. कभी भी कोई चीज जिसे मना किया गया हो या to forbid somebody is called proscribe जो एक verb है तो forbid की जगह पे interchange भी use किया जा सकता है so especially by law कोई भी चीज जो law के द्वारा मना किया गया हो जैसे कि आप कह सकते हो कि public place पे smoking एक proscribed चीज है है ना so many states have laws that proscribe texting while driving ये तो कभी भी नहीं करना चाहिए जब भी कोई drive करे उसे texting नहीं करनी चाहिए in the uh, general sense also. So all unnecessary ornament was uh, prescribed at the airport. So bohat ji jada 
अननेसेसरी जो ऑर्नामेंट होते हैं उसे मना किया गया है सो दीज आर जस्ट एग्जाम्पल्स टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस वर्ड प्रोस्क्राइब इट सिंपली मीन्स टू फोबिड so the synonyms are ban and prohibit the both are kind of legal word and official word so prescribe forbid ban prohibit all words are similar huh? so they are synonymous ideas too antonyms are allow and permit needless to tell you about the antonyms allow and permit so here was the first fourth word now moving forward the last word is menace menace ke bare mein ek cheez main bata do this is also a noun and also a verb depends upon the context how this word has been placed in a sentence so kaise samjhenge ki menace is used as an adjective or noun sorry verb or noun so drunk drivers are a menace to everyone so here an article is there so you can simply say it is a noun kyunki noun se pehle articles hote hain to bahut sare jo drunk driver hote hain jo sharab pi ke gaadi chalate hain that is also proscribed so aap yahan se ek relate kar sakte ho ki drinking uh dr drunk and drive is uh, prohibited and prescribed right so drunk drivers are a menace to everyone jab bhi koi vyakti sharab pi ke gaadi chalata hai wo sabke liye kya hai ek khatra hai so menace means a person or thing that is likely to cause harm ek vyakti ya koi bhi cheez jo uh, khatra paida kar sakti hai that is called menace नाउ इसे वर्ब की तरह भी कैसे यूज कर सकते हैं टू कॉन्स्टिट्यूट अ थ्रेट टू लाइक मेनी फार्म लैंड आर मैनेज बाई फ्लड्स है ना सो यू कैन सिंपली से द वर्ड ई डी हैज बीन एडेड एट द लास्ट सब फिक्स हैज बीन एडेड एट द लास्ट सो बहुत सारे फार्म लैंड है जब फ्लड आते हैं तो वो मैनेज हो जाते हैं मतलब खराब हो जाते हैं now uh, synonyms are जियोपडाइज जियोपडाइज मीन्स टू पुट समथिंग इन डेंजर एंड एम्पेरियल Uh, the antonym of this word is friendly. So these were some words. I hope you understood them well. एक बार रिवाइज कर लेते हैं कौन कौन से शब्द आज हमने सीखा The first one is expeditious. किसी काम को जल्दी से करना या कराना This word can be used in so many way like uh, as a verb expedite, as an adjective expeditious, as an adverb expeditiously. The second word dreadful is a is an adjective. Dreadful means कोई भी चीज that is extremely bad the third one is overweening means a person who is overconfident the fourth word is proscribe it can be replaced with the words uh, forbid ban prohibit this is a law related word so proscribe means kisi bhi cheez ki manahi and the last word was uh, menace means a person that is a danger to society or a thing or it can also be used as a a uh, verb that is to constitute a threat to uh, so many farmlands are menaced by flood i hope you understood the verbs and you will start using them in your day to day conversation you will realize you will um, utilize the words in your daily sentences too and you will also share this video to other friends as well so that they may be benefit you can also uh, keep uh, following us on youtube for regular updates and informative videos you can join our telegram channel wherein we post uh, passages and we also post answers to them and they are uh, complimentary basis for regular updates on law you can uh, follow us on facebook and instagram i wish you all the best thank you